Welcome to this video on Dynatrace for Azure Solution. My name is Jay Gabani, and I'm a Partner Solutions Architect here at Dynatrace. Today, I'm excited to show you our newest offering on Azure. So let's get started. Dynatrace and Microsoft are excited to announce our Dynatrace for Azure solution. Through our enhanced partnership, we've created an automated and streamlined experience for purchasing, configuring, and managing Dynatrace directly inside the Azure portal. Now it's easier than ever for Dynatrace and Microsoft's joint customers to leverage Dynatrace's deep cloud observability, advanced AI ops, and continuous runtime application capabilities in Microsoft Azure. By providing the most comprehensive and easy to deploy intelligent observability solution in the market, Dynatrace and Microsoft lay the groundwork for you to successfully modernize and migrate to the cloud with speed and scalability. Now, once you've purchased our solution through the Azure Marketplace through a private offer that we've published to your tenant, you will then need to subscribe to the offer and create the Azure resource within your subscription. During the resource creation process, you will need to provide the typical input such as resource group you wanna place this Azure resource in, the resource name for this, and then also other inputs such as which Azure region. As you can see, Dynatrace is now a native Azure resource that's created by the Azure Marketplace to ingest observability data from a variety of Azure resources like Azure VMs and App Services. Now let's walk through some of the Dynatrace environment configuration screens within the Azure portal to show you how easy it is to manage your Dynatrace environment. When you go to the monitored resources view, this gives you a central view of all the Azure resources that are currently sending their observability data to the Dynatrace platform in Azure. If you wanted to quickly deploy one agent to a virtual machine, you can select which VM you want to deploy it to and click on install extension. Within minutes, one agent is automatically deployed to the VM and discovers whatever processes you have running on that host. Based on what it finds, one agent can then automatically activate instrumentations specifically for your application stack, as well as auto-inject tags into your web application pages. Any new processes or components get auto-instrumented on the fly. That's the beauty of our one agent. Now, same goes for one agent on Azure App Services. You can quickly select which .NET app you want to deploy it to, and then click on Install Extension. It's that easy. Now, if I were to go back to the Azure Resource Overview screen, we can leverage our single sign-on capability from Azure to go directly into the Dynatrace platform. Once you're in your Dynatrace environment, you can quickly assess which Azure resources are sending their observability data to Dynatrace platform. In this view, now you're able to see log data for all of the Azure resources we've tagged to send to the Dynatrace platform. We can also pull up any metrics for any hosts that we've set up with one agent or view any Azure Kubernetes clusters we're monitoring with Dynatrace. If we wanted to look at an interactive visualization of dynamic relationship of all of our application components running in Azure, we can come to our Smartscape view. Our Smartscape view is built by our one agent, which discovers all of the components and dependencies in your application. And then our Smartscape technology simultaneously builds an interactive map of how everything is interconnected. You've now seen just how automated and streamlined the experience for purchasing, configuring, and managing Dynatrace directly inside the Azure portal. If you need additional details, please check out our blog article or our marketplace listing on Dynatrace for Azure.